There is one word that describes the night he came, ordinary. The sky was ordinary. An occasional gust stirred the leaves and chilled the air. The stars were diamonds sparkling on black velvet. Sheets of clouds floated in front of the moon. It was a beautiful night, a night worth peeking out your bedroom window to admire, but not really an unusual one. No reason to expect a surprise, nothing to keep a person awake. An ordinary night with an ordinary sky. The sheep were ordinary, some fat, some scrawny, some with barrel bellies, some with twig legs, common animals, no fleece made of gold, no history makers, no blue ribbon winners. They were simply sheep, lumpy sleeping silhouettes on a hillside. And the shepherds, peasants they were, probably wearing all the clothes they owned, smelling like sheep and looking just as woolly. They were conscientious, willing to spend the night with their flocks but you won't find their staffs in a museum, nor their writings in a library. No one asked their opinion on social justice or the application of the Torah. They were nameless and simple. An ordinary night with ordinary sheep and ordinary shepherds. And were it not for a God who loves to put an extra on the front of the ordinary, the night would have gone unnoticed. The sheep would have been forgotten and the shepherds would have slept the night away. But God dances amidst the common, and that night he did a waltz. The black sky exploded with brightness. Trees that had been shadows jumped into clarity. Sheep that had been silence became a chorus of curiosity. One minute the shepherd was dead asleep. The next he was rubbing his eyes and staring into the face of an alien. The night was ordinary no more.